Afternoon everyone, it is about 1.30 p.m. and I'm having a difficult time with this one. Today is the day, the first day that I've ever actively tried to stop him having a nap. So that's what I'm doing. I'm preventing him from having a nap. He keeps coming up to me like he wants to sleep and I'm like, no, you're not gonna sleep. You are not having a nap no. today. You're gonna be so tired by the end of today that you're just gonna sleep at nine o'clock or eight o'clock no. all night. And, look, he's doing it again. And he's gonna start eating some food today as well because he's avoiding eating food. He just wants milk. So today, he's gonna go a little bit longer before he gets his milk and he's gonna have to try and eat some food in the meantime. Otherwise, he's just gonna feel hungry. Right, Oscar? He usually has his milk. He usually has his milk every two, two and a half hours. So far, it's been about four and a half hours. <laughs> He's had some bread, a little bit of bread, and I've tried to feed him like the food that we prepared for him, like some potatoes and carrots and tomatoes, like put all together. But he ain't eating it, so I'm gonna wait a bit longer. He's got to get hungrier, that's all. When people are hungry, they eat anything, so that's what I'm gonna try and do. Let him get really hungry so that he'll just eat. It's not bad food, and it's not that he doesn't like it, he's eaten it before. It's just that he wants his milk, he just prefers the milk, and he needs to get out of that because he's going to be one soon. So, yeah, there's that. Hey, no sleeping. Sorry. <laughs> Say hi to everyone. We'll just kick the bag that's on this little sofa. Alright, just thought I'd give you a little update. Alright, get back to playing, Oscar. Go, go, go! Yeah! Go, go, go! Yeah! Go, go, go! <laughs> He doesn't want to play either, he just wants to stand right here. Oh, it's so hot. Air conditioning's on, but I didn't put it up too high because, you know, Oscar, I don't want him to get too cold because he's like quite low down. And if I go low down, I can feel the cool air. But when I stand up, it feels really warm. Oscar, no sleeping today, okay? Good play. Go. <laughs> so, everyone, it's been, let me just check, it's been. Nearly six hours since he had anything like to eat or drink like sufficient. Um, like he hasn't had milk for six hours basically. He's had nibbles of bread, like bits of. I've been plucking bits of bread off like you know got some bread and I've been taking little bits and he, he's really enthusiastic about the bread but it's so small it's not enough and he's not eating his food at all so that's pretty much wasted now. So, mom. So we have a hungry, tired little baby here. Um, I'm still not going to let him sleep because, it, honestly, it's ridiculous. 2.30 a.m.? Ridiculous. I'm not doing that again. Not today. So he's still not going to sleep, but I might, in a bit, I might just give him some milk because I think for a little baby like this, six hours is a long time with no, you know, sufficient meal. Even I've had food. Not a lot, but... Oscar! Yeah. Anyway, we use this app called Baby Tracker to check... Because it's easy to forget, you know, when did he have milk, when did he have a nap, um, all that stuff. How long has he been sleeping every day? Because without using a stopwatch or writing it down, it gets a bit like, you know, you get... It's so easy to get confused about when you think he ate. Because we're always like, yeah, it was about 20 minutes ago. And then we look like, oh my god, hour and a half? Okay, let's give him something more. Um, so we use the Baby Tracker app, and it's really good. So I'd recommend it if you have a baby, um, newborn to probably, I don't know, two, three years old. I guess we're gonna still use it until then. Uh, really, really good app. And every time you do something, so he changes nappy, um, he goes to sleep, he wakes up, feed him something, give him milk, whatever, um, breastfeed, all these different things, you just add it up and you just register it on the app, click, 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 and then later you can just have a look. At the end of the day, you can see, you know, how much has he been drinking or eating, how much did he sleep today, how many times did he have a poo, change his nappy, because it's so easy to forget. And sometimes these things are really important, especially if you need to go to the hospital or the doctor, they might ask you, you know, how much has he been drinking or eating, and you're like, well, I don't really know, but we know, we know everything, so it's all good. All right, let's go. Go. Update. I won. Six and a half hours with no milk and no proper food, and then he finally caved in. He ate the food that I prepared for him this morning. 
and yeah, so that was good. So as soon as he ate that, I gave him the milk because that's what he wanted really, so yeah. But when he was eating that food, I felt so bad because he was so sad. I could see it in his face, he was just like this. So sad, so sad. But anyway, he needed to eat that. It was like potatoes, carrots, tomato, and what, I don't know healthy stuff. He needs to eat some normal food. I want him to learn, like, eat food and then you can have milk. He can still have milk. I don't mind if he has milk. I just want him to eat normal food as well. So, I won the battle. He fell asleep while he was drinking the milk, so I thought, okay, fine. I'll let him sleep for a maximum of one hour and I'm just going to continue doing everything like I normally would. Make as much noise as normal, like not going crazy or anything, but just make as much noise as usual and um, if he wakes up, he wakes up, but the most he's going to sleep right now is one hour. I'll let him sleep one hour, and then after this nap, the most I'm going to let him sleep for any other naps is half an hour. And then tonight, he's going to sleep at a normal time, and hopefully throughout the whole night, because he'll be so tired. Because 2am? That's ridiculous, ridiculous. I'm not going to do this every day. I don't know how many times in this video I've said that, but I'm, this is the, I'm not doing it again, so it ends today. And so far, so good. Six and a half hours of just 100% accompanying that boy around the house, doing nothing for myself. I'm gonna eat my breakfast now. I had some tea, like in between the gaps and whatever while he was playing with his toys, I had some tea. That's all I've had, nothing. So I need to eat something, I'm gonna eat some breakfast right now and relax for this 50 minutes I've got left. Oh, life as a dad, trying to, teach this boy some lessons, you know, life lessons. It's not easy. Dinner is here. Oscar? Hey, baby? Like yesterday, we decided to come out for a bit. Successfully managed to keep Oscar awake for most of the day. Uh, he only slept for like an hour and 15 or something like that. So, all good. All good, looking like he's gonna sleep all night. He's tired already, but we don't care. It's not late enough yet, it's half past nine. He's probably gonna sleep, let him sleep at about 10, half past 10. So, yeah, success. And the food thing, well, he ate one meal and the rest was milk, so. Oscar, you need to eat more, okay? I hope there's no mosquitoes. The other day I was bitten by a few mosquitoes when we came out, so I'm hoping for no mosquitoes today. Yeah, I forgot we were supposed to buy us some shoes. Sorry, baby. Oscar, look here. Oscar. Yeah. Oscar. Hey. 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 And we are back at home and success. Oscar is asleep now, it is 10.30 p.m. He just had the last milk before bed and now he's sleeping. 10.30. I'm just hoping that this is sleeping through the night and not sleeping for a few hours and waking up. He only slept for one hour today, like during the day, so I have a feeling he'll be able to sleep throughout the whole night. So. success. Well, partial success. He didn't eat as much as we wanted him to, but the sleeping is the main thing. Now, at least tomorrow, Hillary's waking up at 6.30, so she should be able to get a good sleep. 
and when I go to bed, I'll be able to get a good sleep because I'm hoping he'll just wake up in the morning and then that'll be fine. Rather than two hours, two hours, oh, two hours, two hours, it kills me. Anyway, that's all for now. I'm just happy about the success, so I will be there and I'll see you tomorrow. Speak to you in the morning. Bye.